So many Steam Next Fest demos, so little time. Next up is Pom Pom the Great Space Rescue. This is freaking cute. <laughs> now this game is about a happy little friend. Uh, however, you are not playing as them, you're playing as the cursor. So instead of it being a platformer, this is a platform placer. Can you dig it? So kind of similar to Lemmings, I suppose. Basically, Pom Pom will be moving on their own and we'll be placing stuff down. I don't know why I'm still holding my controller for this. I'm gonna be using the mouse. <laughs> I'm using tilt controls. Let's begin. It looks really cute. I'm really interested to see how this plays out. I was really hoping as a platformer, but maybe it'll prove me wrong. One day, Pom Pom was working up a sweat when... Hoshi burst into the room. <laughs> Hello there, Mr. Uh, Doramon style character. <laughs> Pom Pom, look what I found. It's a math equation. The Chaos Emeralds. I heard a boom and gems fell from the sky. <laughs> Live and learn. Suddenly, wheel, 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 wheel. What the heck is this? Oh no! Meow, our sensors say the jewels are here, boys. This is very cool. Very anime, I love it. That kid's gotta have them. Grab them. <laughs> What's that, Captain Purloin? <laughs> what luck, we got our treasure and a new cabin boy. Something, something, walk the plank. Was that Garfield? He can scrub our poop deck cling. <laughs> what? I don't wanna know about that. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Peace. That's not what pirates say. They don't say let's blow the popsicle stand. <laughs> Pom-pom, help! The Chaos Emeralds, Pom-pom! They're pivotal to the ending! Get ready, here we go. So Pom-pom walks and jumps on his own. A hop. A leap. Pom-pom, oh, and you can stop time by clicking the right mouse button. <laughs> Zoom, d -d 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 -d. <laughs> Pom Pom will collect blocks he finds in bubbles. This is very cute. Hold space to stop time or you can just right click. Left click to place down the blocks. Pretty cool. I don't know if it's infinite or not. Click to place the blocks when time is frozen. Pom Pom, how many blocks can you place in the frozen time? <laughs> Can I cheat and just like create a giant path upward? Yeah, 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 let's go to the very top. <laughs> go, Pom Pom, go. You got this. <laughs> How high up can Pom Pom go actually? Like, can you, can you go all the way to the tippy top? And it seems like you can only place blocks when Pom Pom is standing still. Whoa. Okay. Freezing time depletes the bar. Oh, I totally didn't even notice that. Did they just add that in a second ago? <laughs> yeah, they're, they're, this is the rules changing. This is your block in your inventory. Uh, can you make that jump, little guy? Oh, no. All the way back here, really? Oh, man. <laughs> it's not that far. Okay, let's be smart about it this time. I, I I was curious to see if that jump could be made. I'm sorry. Maybe now it can be made. There we go. <laughs> Use scroll wheel or A and D to switch between blocks. All right, cool. Whoops. I done goofed. But I'm guessing that was good enough. Uh, I can just leave that in the center, right? Cool. Very nice. Checkpoints give you a second chance bubble. That's good to know. Move your cursor where you want Pom Pom's bubble to go. Use this to advance. Oh, look at that. Look at the little wheelie ah, animation. <laughs> Help. Get me out of here. Somebody save me. <laughs> Pom Pom, you can do it. Let's place a block here, place a block here, ample space. That might be a little too far. Yep, that would have been disastrous. Oh dear. 
but it's okay because he made it to the side. Nice job, Pom Pom. You got this. You can save your uh, Doramon friend. Oh, look at this. I like mode seven kind of scrolling here. They've taken over a planet. Rather, they've arrived at a planet. Is that the, um, what's the name of the the fighter from um, Slap City, the, the big fish boy, like ult ultimate beef master or whatever? Demo Zone, Springtime Meadows. Sounds good to me. This is so cute. Get ready, go. Alrighty. I'm going to uh, assume that that's how high up um, and now we see one of the inherent problems with this uh, gameplay mechanic. The lack of control is a bit of a problem. Uh-oh. It's fine. Can I just float over here? I'm sure nothing bad will happen. So again, um, you know, this is really cute. I'm really not sure if... Um, uh, Pom Pom, you okay? All right, I was gonna say. I'm not too certain if this is the best kind of. I don't. I don't know. I don't want to be rude, but I would actually much rather prefer prefer if this was a platformer. I know that sounds kind of generic. I'm not trying to be rude. This is really cute, and I love it a lot. I just feel like. Oh gosh. I just feel like um, the controls themselves could lend themselves to some very precarious situations. Maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just my, uh, I love platformers so much. Timber River. I mean, it's, it's, it's not too difficult. I just imagine later on, there's gonna be a lot of juggling to do. Oh, look at this lovely little water area with the log. <laughs> This is very Super Mario World. Even a little, little fish down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Pom Pom, you got this. <laughs> it is insanely cute, and I am a sucker for anything like a uh, hamster or adorable. Are you gonna make that jump? Just barely, my goodness. What a close call that was. Oh, there's a lovely carrot up there. Unfortunately, I will not be able to get that. Should have seen it coming, right? Are you gonna make that jump? I don't think you're gonna make that jump. Let's be careful here. Let's be very, very careful. Oh, look at those little chickadees. I don't know if I can actually damage them. So I'm just gonna let him pass by peacefully. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, see, already, we gotta be careful. Otherwise, things could end very poorly. You gotta do this all on the fly at the exact proper angles. I mean, I'm kind of, you know, getting into the muscle memory here. It's fine. Pom Pom is at the very end now and it's all good to go. Yeah, see? Give me what for? <laughs> so adorable. It's definitely very unique. I really enjoy this. Toy umbrellas. Let's go. Just be careful which shape you choose. Umbrella is not the best choice. If you know, you know. I'm gonna have to pop that, aren't I? Try using your cursor on pom-pom or objects in the world if you feel stuck. Oh, that's cool. Give pom-pom a little blasterino there. Oh, that was a bad idea. Oh, it's, it's fine. We're good. Nice job, pom-pom. You just gotta watch out for the, um... For the acceleration here. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, double oh wow, whoops. <laughs> I kind of panicked for a second there. I wasn't sure how the mechanic was gonna work out. Watch out for those toy soldiers. Oh, we can bonk them! I don't know why I wasted my umbrellas there. 
I thought I had to float over them when I could have smacked them. This is gonna be a problem. <laughs> go, Pom Pom, go! Yeah. <laughs> kinda, kinda got a bit of a problem here. I appear to have been soft locked. Also, I clicked out of the game. Let's reset to checkpoint. Which is the start of the level. Okay, well, uh, so there can definitely be situations where you soft lock immediately. I don't know how I feel about that, but maybe that's on me. That's what I get for not properly timing it out. Oh, that was very close. I almost uh, bamboozled myself there pretty hard. Okay. I also didn't think I was gonna make that either. My gosh. No, oh, Pop-Pop, wait, come back! <laughs> Woo! Okay, well, I definitely can't do this or I'll be soft-locked again. Okay. <laughs> you see what I mean? If this was a platform, I wouldn't be having any problems right now. But it's a very unique mechanic. Uh, I do appreciate it. Second chance. I think I already have that on. Freeze time, large, crouch time. We'll just keep it at the regular stuff. <laughs> Barely like... 10 minutes into playing the game, and I'm already having quite a little bit of difficulty. That might just be on me, though. That might just be me trying to, you know, play the game in a different way. I gotta get acclimated. I will say, the gameplay is very smooth. I appreciate that a lot. It is very, um... There we go. I gotta get higher up this time. Yeah. It's very like, this is a game that would have come out on um, Game Boy Advance. There we go, see? This had to get good. Whoops. <laughs> Speaking of. <laughs> you gonna be okay there? I think we're gonna make it through. Yeah, 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 we're good. Made it through that roadblock pretty quick. Lickety split. Honestly, the resetting isn't a bad idea. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Just had to readjust the world really quick. Don't mind me. But this is so adorable and charming. I love it. Just bonk that toy soldier. That'll show him. Yeah, I, I just gotta get used to placing all these things properly. <laughs> you know, <laughs> bump bump. I'm sorry, Pom Pom. I didn't mean it. But you're gonna make this, right? Okay, a little bit of a problem here. Um, I think we should be okay. Yeah, there we go. Go, Pom Pom. Go, go, go. We got some springs apparently too. I should probably use those in some capacity. Oh my goodness, that was a close call. <laughs> I'm really enjoying the interacting with the uh, environment on this, though. It's really nice. Pom-pom, he just jumped over as soon as I talked about how interactivity is really good. <laughs> he just jumped right over what I was trying to show everybody. Anyway. We're going into Sunfish Lagoon now. Let's see what awaits. Oh, is that a Mola Mola I see down there? It's a sunfish. I should have clicked on the fish, probably. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Friendly friends. They can flap in the sky, apparently. I'm just gonna go ahead and reset so that I don't die. <laughs> you gotta watch the timing on when you poke those lovely little fish. Speaking of, I'm gonna reset so I don't die. 
Now there is a coin counter, so there's the incentive to replay every stage to make sure you collect everything. And I'm sure that's gonna bug me immensely when I try to do that later on. <laughs> but no big deal. We're in the here and now. We're here to support Pom Pom in his time of need as he journeys into the stratosphere to find some sort of, uh... Oh, sorry about that, Mr. Bird. To find his friends that have been kidnapped by the, uh, pirate cats or whatever. Captain, uh... Captain Briny Paw or whatever. <laughs> it's a cool design. I'm not sure exactly how it's gonna tie into the... There was a coconut there that explodes. I guess I'll take the top path, sure. Let's ignore everything else, I guess. <laughs> Could've used one of the fish and not one of the platforms. Let's bounce that big old ball away from here, shall we? Well, that entire exchange was all sorts of wrong. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. <laughs> pom pom, please. You're cute, but you gotta watch out for the explosions. It's a dangerous world out there. I'm not quite sure how to get that carrot, though. Oh, I forgot that's the upper path. Duh. <laughs> Perhaps a well-placed platform will prevent that sort of craziness happening. I suppose I'll ignore it for now. It's going to be interesting trying to figure out how to get all of these secrets in the future. What? Pom Pom just phased through reality. I suppose that was my fault. <laughs> Let's jump on a bunch of birds. That just totally missed the point. Jump Pom Pom, go over the goal. <laughs> Maybe there's boss fights. How's that gonna work? Speaking of, looks like we're not going to the ship itself, but we are going to the haunted manor. Ooh, spooky. Just like those ghost houses. Very, very similar to those ghost houses. Oh, and we can keep the, um, what do we call these guys? The, the spookters, the spe specterinos. We can't just call them booze. The, the ghoul, the ghoul, the ghoul logs, the ghouly, the Gre Gregories. Yes, we got to watch out for the Gregories. We got to carry the lantern while also placing platforms. All right, now this is really cool. I actually like this a whole lot. I got to remember to stop time, though. And we can't lose out. Whoops. Let's not lose the lantern. This juggling is actually really cool. I like this a lot. So this is the kind of stuff that you probably wouldn't have in just a regular platformer, though juggling while doing a platformer sounds like a pretty fun thing. Or maybe it'd be cumbersome, I don't know. Well, I guess I deserve that one. <laughs> I totally deserve that one. I'm gonna place this where the blocks should be. I'm just glad the pom-pom didn't just plummet into the depths again. That would have been rather peculiar. It's actually, it's kind of fun to try to adapt to it in real time rather than just stopping time. I think it would be really cool to see like um, a couple of interesting speed runs for this. I say that about everything, but I think, I mean, you can't really speed run when it's an auto-scroller, I guess, but it would be very cool to see um, the optimized ways that people play this. Though, I don't know, ooh, uh, we got a spooky friend here. Go bonk him. Or I guess you can ignore. Yeah, that'll show him who's boss. You're not gonna make that jump, are you? Dunk. I probably needed to make an upward path. Yeah, there we go. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get it, but just to be safe, I'll hold off. 
And that's not especially high enough, so, you know, we'll just head to the end. No big deal. Drop that lantern down, and we are out of the haunted house. It's a, a spooky, scary, nothing too scary, I guess. Oh, there's still more. Yeah, yeah. There, this is, um, there's quite a lot of stuff here. Ancient overgrowth. Let's see what awaits. What's inside? Oh, we got a sticker brush symphony here. Oh, this is infinite. Okay. Another really cool mechanic, once again, proving that I'm a, a silly billy, saying that, oh, well, maybe it should just be a platformer. That's my bad. I needed to give a chance to be creative first. Oh, well, speaking of, I need to... Wait, that's not the trajectory I thought you were gonna go. Hold on, little buddy. <laughs> Woo! Gotta be careful. Wait. Uh, this might be a problem. See you later, chickadee. No, don't jump there! No! <laughs> Pom Pom, why? Why, though? That's dangerous, my friend. You gotta watch out for those plummeting depths. Gotta get the garden trimmers out. <laughs> Oh, look at this lovely little temple here. Oh, it takes away all your stuff. I see. All right. Um, what the heck am I supposed to do here? How do you- No, Papa, where are you going? <laughs> no! Now, what are you doing, Shulk? <laughs> so you're starting to see where some of the problems come in. Looks like I'm gonna have to jump. Actually, I'm wondering if Pom Pom is patient enough to just straight up wait. Uh, they're probably gonna be able to jump over here. Pom Pom, no! Well, that's what I get. Uh, I'm gonna very quickly chop an upward pathway. Pom Pom, no! Whew. Okay, that's good to know. You can instantly reverse, so you can give Pom Pom like a little bit of uh, leeway here. So there's no need to panic too much. If you get turned around, no big deal. You just gotta adjust. And it'll all work out accordingly. Nice. Alrighty. Next, we have Lightweight Lift. Get ready. Oh, we're going on a balloon trip. Um... Oh, that's for moving. Okay, I thought I was gonna, like, accidentally, like, explode the balloon. Oh! This is literally, like, you have to, um... You can take it at any angle? Oh, now this is really cool! Game is really proving itself very quickly. Oh, hold on. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down there. Let's not go zooming up into the sky that quickly. You gotta watch. <laughs> you, gotta watch <laughs> you gotta watch out, he says, as he runs the friend into the ground. No, Pom Pom, you were supposed to go the other one. Okay. Well, you know what? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, little buddy. I got you covered. Physics be darned. We're gonna be very careful. Ooh, ooh, whoa, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I want to collect all the coins, even though I'm not, like, gonna be able to. <laughs> That's not... I thought I could dash in like I did earlier. The cool mechanic is uh, about to become a little bit uh, obnoxious. <laughs> Mostly because I'm uh, being a goofball here, trying to do things I shouldn't. Like bouncing him around. It's fine. It'll work out. Everything works out eventually. Careful. Mind the spikes. 
All righty. See, now we're getting there. Uh, I feel like I should go to the right side. There's probably a coin that way. But I do see a carrot here. That was dangerous. <laughs> you can bump it from the bottom. See, that's what I was trying to do. Oh. Uh, this is a little, um, little hard to control by design, but I will overcome it by being very careful. By being very careful. By being very... <laughs> Wait, get down with the... Papa, please! <laughs> oh, no! How can such cute music be so deceptive? This is a fight for my life. <laughs> hey, I made it, though. As long as no handy spikes along the way. All right, all right, we're good, we're good. Oh, we're not good, but we're kind of good. We're gonna make it. You just gotta go for it, you know? No time to wait. No time to blubber around. Just keep pressing on. <laughs> keep going, Pom Pom. Did I miss three coins? They're probably up the very top, huh? Yeah, here we go, all right, cool. We did it. I actually, like, made it through that level. That was a really cool idea. It took a little getting used to, but let's have some celebratory balloons. Nice. I'm assuming this is the final level of the demo. This is, uh... Caterlin's ship. Yar, matey. This definitely is 100% an airship. A thousand percent an airship. I mean, I was actually going to, um, you know, like... Go down that way, but I ended up going up to the top. Whoops! Uh, well, I'm not trapped yet. I still have a spring here. It kind of wears his inspiration on its sleeve, but that's not a bad thing. Oh, we got wedges here. What? <laughs> cool. Let's wedge our way up to the top then. <laughs> I really like this a lot. Takes a little getting used to. Don't know how I made that jump. <laughs> but the flow is pretty good. I haven't felt, like, uh, extremely pressured in terms of feeling like I'm failing the jumps and stuff. Uh, speaking of... It's fine. <laughs> I made it through! <laughs> Never mind. Didn't make it after all. Please don't fall between the cracks. You're about to fall between the cracks, weren't you? Uh, this is bad. This is fine. This is bad. This is fine. This is bad. <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> well, I'm soft locked again. No, I'm good. This is fine. See? All I had to do was just trust myself. Bonk. It's good. <laughs> okay, now it's a little more hectic. Jump on that kitty cat, thunk. <laughs> I don't mind it though. I'm really liking the, uh, almost like a sense of urgency. Oh, well, I mean, uh, you did that on your own, pom pom. Oh, we got a fight here. Dun, 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 dun. How do we take down this friend? Oh. That cat abandoned ship. After him. We gotta take him down. Here's our boss fight. We got unlimited blocks. How is this gonna work out? Oh, that's really cool. Listen to this music, though. 
Donk. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. I'm sold. Turn around, little guy. Bonk him on the noggin. No, go the other way, though. I wish that I could turn around on the fly. That would be pretty cool. We got a showdown here. I guess I can force the turnaround. Let's go! No, so close to the one. No, 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 go the other way. No! <laughs> Turn around! Pom pom, please! Bounce over here! No, pom pom, wait. Well, I mean, it worked out. It worked to some extent. Oh, this music, this is very Super Nintendo. Dun 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 dun. Thunk. You did it! Congratulations, Pom Pom! You really made it happen! Oh, With Bosm Caterline defeated, Pom Pom is one step closer to Captain Cat's lair. Take that, Caterline. Hoshi is counting on you. Keep searching the galaxy. Pom Pom, you can do it. You sure can, I think. Absolutely charming. Thank you for playing. That's the end of the pom-pom demo Wow a greater adventure awaits in the full game. Can I burst the umbrella? Would that be rude? Yeah, cool. Okay <laughs> Wish this on Steam get feedback follow on Twitter. That's right as I've been saying over and over for these demos follow the devs Wishlist the games I've had a whole lot of fun with this. Honestly, I'm gonna be real. I went in a little bit skeptical. I'm usually, you know, I'm not I'm not about the being super judgy immediately. I like to let things speak for themselves. But when I first saw this and I wishlisted it, a part of my brain thought that it was a platformer. And so being introduced to the crosshair mechanic, it actually works pretty well. It's, uh, most of the problem comes from my own floundering, but I think it, it it has promise, and it could be really friggin' fun. I had a lot of fun playing this. I also, again, I really like the fact that you could just play this straight, like you don't have to pause at any time. You can just like frantically, on the fly, toss platforms out, hope things work. And if you mess up, no big deal, just try again. <laughs> so yeah, that was Pom Pom. That was a lot of fun. I'm really interested to see the game, and if you are, wishlist, follow devs, all that good stuff, as usual. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye bye